Hi, welcome to EO Life Education. My name is Rosie Germert, and myself and other EO Life experts, we come here to teach you all about how to use doTERRA's essential oils and doTERRA products. It's our mission that you don't ever have an essential oil or a doTERRA product that you don't know how to use. Hey, if this is your first time here, be sure and subscribe, hit that bell, because then every time that we put something up for you, you'll get notified. And of course, we love it if you would like this video too. We do our very best to answer every single question and we love hearing in the comments about what's working for you. So hey, let's get learning here on EO Life Education. This class. Okay, so Chris, we're ready to turn the time over to you. I'm super excited to learn from you too because your skin is beautiful, girl. Thank you. I'm just really hoping you can hear me. Yes. <laughs> Challenge it. Okay, good. That's good. It's been quite a day, hasn't it? <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much for asking me to present tonight. I love talking about our skincare lines because they are amazing. And I have never stuck with um, skincare products as long as I have doTERRA's. And they just keep coming out with wonderful new products. Uh, so I'm eager to share all about them. For now, everybody who's watching this, I would appreciate if you just would take a moment either to jot down or take a mental note of some of the things that you love about your skin. Um, everybody's skin is going to be completely di different, unique to them. And we're going to have things that we love and then also list things that you want to improve, um, areas of focus so that you're listing for specifics in my presentation that will be able to help you to achieve those goals. Um, our skin is our um, biggest filter organ and it's really a, 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 a representation of our overall health, particularly our, our gut health. And um, so you want to consider environmental factors, um, the climate, you know, of course, winter, summer, your skin's going to be different uh, depending on hormonal cycles uh, for women um, that you might have. And then also, of course, age, our skin changes as we age. So periodically, you want to reassess the things you love and the things that you um, want to improve. And Rosie, you're going to go ahead and switch the slides for me, right? I am. Okay, I don't think I have a way to do that. So <laughs> thanks. There we go. Sorry. All right, great. And like I said, um, our most important filter organ, our largest filter organ, um, needs to be supported in order to have beautiful glowing skin. And one of the most important things we can do is nutrition. By feeding our bodies excellent nutrition, we're going to go ahead and get the best results from our skin. So it's best to pick healthy foods, of course, um, avoiding sugar and processed foods whenever possible, challenging as that can be, it's going to really make a big difference for you. Um, I'm going to talk about hydration in a little bit, but right now I'd like to focus on our lifelong vitality that Rosie mentioned. This trio of vitamins has changed my life and the lives of so many other people, even though um, unlike Rosie, I was never a vitamin taking person until I learned about lifelong vitality and gave it a legitimate try rather than just now and then kind of sampling them because I figured I should know about them since I do represent the company. Um, I kind of just tried them a little bit and then I decided to really give them a decent try. And, um, and wow, have I noticed a difference. I didn't realize that energy could come back with something so simple. Um, a, like Rosie mentioned, little aches and pains, but particularly it's going to feed our skin from the inside out. Then the next thing I'm going to talk about is um, we're going to talk about uh, more about ways to support from the inside. Some additional products besides the Lifelong Vitality Pack. Um, my newest favorite product for my skin is Yarrow Palm, uh, the Beauty Complex. It's amazing. If you haven't tried it yet, please give it a try. Um, for me personally, I noticed after about three or four days that my skin was not only softer on my face where I'm used to feeling uh, variations in softness or, or texture, but um, all over my body, you know, from your, your toes to your ears to, you know, everywhere. It's just, it softens and smooths 
and it's a noticeable difference. You know, you've, you've felt your skin every day for a long time and then all of a sudden it feels different and it feels amazing. So from the inside out, that yarrow palm with the grape seed, vitamin C, that boosts collagen production. And then there's a melon extract in there too that really helps to um, enhance that, that natural youthful glow. Um, another way we can support the gut is by taking uh, one or two terrazyme um, capsules with each meal. Um, another product that I just uh, maybe about a year ago committed to taking regularly and life-changing, let me tell you, I had no idea that I needed it until I tried it and I noticed the difference. Really, you will, give it a try. Uh, supports all of your elimination chimneys, which including your, your skin, which is our largest, um, but also your kidneys and your liver are gonna be very grateful um, that they're able to um, eliminate properly, but also break down all the nutrients in the food that we have because it makes it much easier to digest everything that we that we consume. Um, this is particularly helpful for people who have um, irritated or red skin, but um, I don't have that concern and I just have noticed overall just a digestive um, boost and, uh, and really much healthier overall. Definitely a product I recommend. All right, what do we have next? PB Assist Plus. Uh, this is a really unique patented delivery system that doTERRA created where the outside, um, well, inside the capsule, there's two parts. Um, there's an inner capsule that's colored green with a little bit of natural chlorophyll where the probiotics are hidden inside a um, outer capsule of probiotic, excuse me, prebiotics. The prebiotics open in the stomach and um, help to propagate our um, stomach and our gut with um, healthy prebiotics that, that feed the good, excuse me, that, um, that support the digestion. And then that inner green capsule um, inner part with the probiotics goes ahead and continues unopened down into the intestine where it's needed. So instead of our um, super strong stomach acid digesting um, a significant percentage of the probiotics that we pay good money for, it's really wonderful to know that every bit of that continues on down the digestive tract where it can be fully utilized where it's needed in our um, intestines. So it's really an amazing uh, delivery system that makes it so that you don't have to take a ton of the um, probiotics. It makes them far more affordable for the quantity and quality of probiotics that you get. Um, and it helps to balance um, the good and bad bacteria so that you can have optimal gut health. And that's going to go ahead and show through in your skin. And then the last thing I wanted to mention um, for things we can do for the inside of our body is really Nutrition and water are really the two most important single things you can do. Um, everything else is just going to be really extra benefit, but this is just basics. The water that you consume, your hydration level is going to make a tremendous difference. Um, it's challenging, but try your best to drink at least half your body weight in ounces per day. And I have a 10 ounce bottle that I refill throughout the day. And every time I refill it, I put another rubber band on the bottle so that I can go ahead and count and keep track of exactly what I've consumed in the day because it's a new habit for me and it's really important to me that I follow it because I know how important it is for my overall health and in how I look um, through my skin. I love to add essential oils, um, lemon or grapefruit it mentions here for detox benefits. Um, personally, I love to try a tiny touch of peppermint or a little tiny touch of cinnamon um, also with or without a citrus. It's really fun to mix a little bit. So. Um, experiment and see if you like just a tiny touch, like putting it on a spoon or on a clean finger and putting it in your water, or you can go ahead and drop a full drop if you like that really potent flavor. Um, also, another tip I have is go ahead and give um, lime and tangerine a try. Those two together are fantastic. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get to some common skin issues. The first of which is very, very common and that could be just a little bit of redness in your cheeks or redness throughout um, your body um, from all different kinds of things. But really great way to support it is any one of these pictured products. Um, frankincense, of course, super soothing, calming for the skin, helichrysum the same. Um, and then also one of our newer products, Yarrow Palm, has been a really fantastic addition to my skincare regime that I use every single day, twice a day. 
I go ahead and mix a few drops of that wonderful blue um, yarrow essential oil and pomegranate seed oil blend um, in my hand with my moisturizer. And I go ahead and apply that on my face twice a day as part of my daily regimen. Then I also will take some internally now and then, but now that I'm taking uh, the complex that has some yarrow palm in it, as well as some other amazing ingredients, um, I'm not taking it internally as much, but you can just drop it right under your tongue. It's fantastic for you. It is in those capsules, though. If you have those, then um, you're getting it internally that way. And then, of course, Correct X is a great product for any um, irritations, or it can help to soothe skin, too, if you need something heavier that's in um, a little bit heavier base. The Correct X is like a um, petroleum-free um, almost like a first aid ointment. So for any cracks, uh, cuts, scratches, that kind of thing, it's great. And it can be really good for soothing and calming really irritated skin. One other product that's great for redness um, is Manuka, Manuka, which was available as a um, product of the month recently. So if you happen to have that, then you're really fortunate. That one's really great for the redness. Okay, Rosie, thanks. We'll go to scar tissue now. Sorry. Well, just listening to you talk, I'm like, oh, my hands. I'm going to put, I've got yarrow palm right here. I'm going to put it right. I was working with some chicken wire, so my hands are kind of beat up. So I'm going to put some yarrow palm on them. Yep, yarrow palm is incredible. I just love that stuff. I have some upstairs and I have some downstairs because it also helps with um, anxious feelings. And it's one of my dog's absolute favorites for her nervousness. So I often will use it on my hands to help to moisturize my skin. And then I get the dual benefit of petting her. And then she gets that calming and relaxing feeling that she loves so much. And she just will come and just sit by me when she sees me get the bottle out. So she knows exactly what's going on in that bottle, much more than I do. <laughs> um, so for scars, you know, we all have things that have happened in the past that leave behind um, um, scar tissue. So if you have older scars, it's really great to go ahead and try to condition those, maybe try to minimize them. Um, but if you have a scar forming, it's really, really beneficial to use essential oils to help create that healthy scar tissue from the beginning. Um, so you can go ahead and use great oils like these pictured. We have the geranium essential oil, and then there are two touch rollers, frankincense or neroli fantastic for helping to reduce scars, particularly stretch marks. Um, I shouldn't say particularly because really any scars, but I know that um, my daughters uh, have used Neroli on stretch marks of, as they've developed through their teen years, as they've grown. And it really has been a noticeable difference in minimizing those so that they felt that there was something that can be done after others had told them that there's nothing that can be done about those pesky marks. So um, those are great. And then again, yarrow palm, again, all things skin. It's going to be amazing for you. Um, if you need to moisturize as the scar tissue is forming, um, a nice uh, carrier is like a solid coconut oil for that, the extra nourishment that we get from um, all of the nutrients in the coconut proteins. Um, also, shea butter is fantastic or any other really heavier um, moisturizing, nourishing carrier oils, um, jojoba perhaps, um, castor, some of the heavier oils are really great for um, supporting healthy scar tissue formation. For those of you who are going to get the bonus, I'm going to give you my recipe for making salve too. So um, be sure that you sign up for that. Uh, let's see, for breakouts. Okay, hey, now this is. Chris, I'm just going to throw in for a second because we have had. Where we've had people sign up for the bonus, and what's just coming out in some text threads is that where uh, people haven't gotten the bonus, like in the comments. And so here's what here's what we're gonna do. I'll one of us, maybe not me, we'll take all the bonuses that should have gone out over the last several weeks, and we'll just attach them all to one email, and we'll send that one email to anybody that has signed up for bonuses over the last few weeks. So that'll just kind of Take Perfect. care of all of that, and we'll just start again and fresh with you because you're you're like super consistent, and you'll do a great job at that. So, 
<laughs> Thanks for your vote of confidence. I yeah. need that. Yeah, yeah. So just if you're worried about the bonuses, you're like, well, wait, sometimes I get them, sometimes I don't. Chris is great. She's going to get hers to you and we'll just throw a blanket over all the other ones. and We'll just send them all to anyone that has signed up. So perfect. Okay. Perfect. Two quick things for that. I'm going to have, um, because we're going to give people a little bit of time to watch this video that's recorded uh, through Saturday evening. Anyone who um, is either watching live now or who watches before Saturday um, and we're aware of it. So um, I think, Rosie, you have a, a sign up that will make us aware of who's, uh, who's done that. They're going to go ahead and get not only this, um, the handout that was already, uh, that, that has all of these slides in it or information from all of these slides, but also an extra handout from me with my salve recipe, which is fantastic for extra moisturizing, extra um, protecting, whether you're talking about helping um, healthy scar formation or a lot of people do use it for redness, you know, if you need extra moisture. And so anyway, oh, thanks, Stacy. I love the recipe too. And so I love to share it. So I will be sharing a PDF that has photos, um, recommended ingredients, a few blends. Um, so that's the extra bonus for this class. And then also, Rosie, please make sure before we send out the pet one again, I was actually going to send a notice to everybody I sent it to before. Luckily, I have them in my email that I do have a minor change. I want to take Spearmint off the cat's list. I've been oh. hearing conflicting. Yeah. So, so Spearmint is on the safe list for the cats um, and dogs handout. And it's safe for dogs, but not so much for cats. Um, there's conflict on that, as there are sometimes. And whenever it's conflicting, I always just like to err on the side of caution. So I'm going to take that off my handout. Yeah. And I'll make sure I have that new PDF again by, um, by Sunday morning so we can send those all out. Okay, that sounds perfect. Thanks, Chris. Okay, so back to pimples. Okay, I do know a lot about this because I have two beautiful teenage girls who, of course, their skin is an occasional concern. Um, they have a lot of friends who have more significant concerns and I love to help people with this because I found our, um, these tips I'm gonna share with you are really, really effective. Um, so the, um, of course, there are all different reasons people are gonna have blemishes. Food sensitivities is very common. It's really a nice idea to experiment um, a lot of times both dairy products and wheat can be particular triggers, but everybody's gonna be a little different. So sometimes you have to experiment a little bit with diet and cut back on some of those trigger foods to see if that can make a big difference from the inside out. Um, hormone fluctuations, um, you know, your age is gonna make a big difference in the kind of breakouts you have because uh, your hormones might not be so stable. Um, and then, of course, bacteria and dirt. So changing your pillowcase every two or three days is a wonderful tip I love to share that surprises some people. Um, other people are already doing this habit, but it's really important for the skin on our faces. Um, and then, of course, keeping it nice and clean. And I'm going to share soon ways you can do that using the doTERRA skincare lines. But for blemishes in particular, uh, tea tree oil is a top recommendation. Um, HD Clear is a wonderful blend that um, has all kinds of wonderful skin supporting and purifying oils in it. And then of course, Rose is an amazing oil that has so many different chemical compounds and the versatility of Rose is just incredible. It's wonderful for blemishes because it also, it's naturally antibacterial while it also supports and nurtures healing. So that's a really wonderful one for um, particularly for the redness, trying to get the redness gone, whether it's um, before, during, or after the uh, eruption of a, of a blemish. Um, I'm also going to share with you now um, one of my favorite blemish blends. So if you have a uh, piece of paper, you'll want to write this down. Um, this is a gosh, a tried and true remedy for so many different kinds of pimples. No matter the cause, it's really supportive. And I call it my North Star blend from uh, a commercial back in the 80s for Clearasil, or no, Stridex, sorry, Stridex pads. And um, gosh, it might have been Clearasil. One of those uh, super loaded with chemicals products that uh, was encouraged to be used on skin, but their commercials had the pimples in different constellations of the stars. And of course, the huge one that would show up on your nose or your forehead is known as the North Star. So um, when I had a huge blemish at one point, um, going through perimenopause, I 
created this North Star blend and it has been really amazing for so many different people. So in a 10 mil roller, you're gonna wanna go ahead and put in 16 drops of the tea tree, Melaleuca, eight drops of frankincense, and four drops of patchouli. And if your skin is sensitive, you can use 50% as much um, or even less, you'll know if, you're, if your skin is prone to um, irritation or um, to being a little overwhelmed by the oils, but, um, but that's a great uh, ratio of oils. You fill that up with fractionated coconut oil, which is an amazing carrier because it doesn't clog pores. Super lightweight, soaks in beautifully. You don't get that greasy look. Um, and you can put the, that directly on blemishes or you can roll it in your hand before putting your moisturizer on so that it mixes in your hands with the moisturizer um, for a little bit of overall um, anti-blemish support. So keep that blend on hand and I think you'll be really amazed when you give it a try. All right, next we're gonna talk about discoloration and uneven pigmentation, um, otherwise known as brown spots. And those could be on your hands or on your face um, or elsewhere in your body from sun damage. It's very, very common caused by sun damage um, or as you get older. Um, and then also um, women tend to get dark patches from hormonal pigmentation caused by pregnancy. And um, so I happened to get some of those dark patches when I was pregnant with my girls. And I was told there was nothing I could do except for maybe some chemical peels and some other really drastic measures that didn't sound fun or affordable to me. And so I was so happy when I gave um, the doTERRA products a try for that. We've got several great, um, great suggestions here. I would also add the Immortel blend to that because um, that is really high in frankincense and so many other wonderful oils that are supportive for evening out pigmentation. Um, so I just would roll the Immortel in my hand and evenly apply it with my moisturizer as well. But, um, but you can also just touch a little bit on those extra challenging areas that you want to try to even out, uh, whether it's frankincense or black spruce, Hawaiian sandalwood or lavender. And I would also like to add to this blue tansy. Um, blue tansy is amazing for evening out skin pigmentation as well, but it does have about um, 20 minutes to 60 minutes of the color blue if it's not super well diluted. So just know that you're not going to want to put that on right before you head out to get your picture taken or maybe um, right before you go to do something important where people aren't going to be concerned that you look a little like a Smurf. <laughs> At nighttime is a great time to use blue tansy because a little bit of blue isn't going to bug you because you're going to look so great in the morning. All right, let's see. I think that's it for common skin. Oh, we have aging. Okay, so I like to call this mature skin. <laughs> um, and as we mature, we get the fine lines, wrinkles, and a little bit of loose skin. Um, of course, hydration is going to be key for this, so everybody needs to have proper hydration, but if this is one of your main concerns, really make an effort to put in the quantity of water that you need every day. Um, I really love using Immortel, as I mentioned before. Um, also, Neroli is a wonderful pre-diluted touch here, or um, using myrrh or frankincense. Um, either with your moisturizer or with a carrier oil for extra support as our skin ages. And um, yeah, I think that's it for aging, but you know, just you'll be amazed that you have those products because it really, truly makes a difference. I get compliments on my skin all the time. So this line here is wonderful. This is our Virage skincare line. It's four simple products. Um, it's ideal for aging and mature skin, and also for those who really want to have an all clean, uh, very easy to read label, so you know that um, it's just 100% plant ingredients, nothing has been altered in the lab, it's um, just really natural, simple. Um, it's our newest line, and it's been incredibly popular. Uh, there are four parts, so let's see, the tall one, on the left, let's see, first we'll start off with the tall white tube, and that is the cleanser, and it's kind of a gel cleanser. Um, my youngest daughter says this is her favorite. 
cleanser and um, it's just really easy to use, cleanses beautifully. Right after that, you're gonna go ahead and follow up with uh, my favorite toner, actually. I use pieces from the different lines because I've been fortunate enough to be able to experiment a bit. And the toner is my favorite toner. It comes in a really easy to use pump. So I spray that onto a cotton pad or a cotton ball to be able to apply it to my skin. Um, there are others who just mist it on their face, but I don't really care to get it in my hair. So I control it by putting on a cotton ball and wiping, and that will help to clear out any, um, anything that's left behind, any extra dead skin. Um, you know, if, you're, if, if it's not a day that you're exfoliating, it's gonna help to clear up your pores and also kind of, um, shrink those pores a little bit so that they're less likely to get clogged. Um, again, that's super, and it's a wonderful product to spritz on over a sunburn. There's a little tip for you. Feels so good and helps to soothe um, a sunburn. There are other things you can do to soothe a sunburn, but that one's quick and easy and always by my sink, so I love that product for that. Um, and then we have the, let me move this comment, there we go. We have the uh, Raj Moisturizer, which is the taller of the two green pumps on the right. Um, that one's a nice light moisturizer. It feels fantastic on your skin. Um, and then we have the light green pump there toward the center, and that is the Immortel Serum, and that is amazing. So if the Immortel is a little too potent to blend for you, it is undiluted, the Immortel, when it comes. Um, you can either pop the roller and make a diluted roller for yourself if your skin is a little more sensitive or if you want to um, add that uh, fractionated coconut oil to spread it over a larger area. Um, but also this serum is a great alternative because it is the Immortel blend with all of the skin nourishing ingredients um, together with other nourishing oils that just give a really healthy glow uh, to skin of all ages and skin types. Next line is another special. So this is a specialty line for, um, I don't wanna call it problem skin, but we could go ahead and call it blemish prone skin um, or um, skin that needs smoothing and clearing. Acne prone skin, I guess they have it written here. That sounds good. So um, let's start with the right side, which is the foaming face wash. And that is the face wash that I've used ever since um, I started breaking out again um, later in life. And it keeps my skin wonderfully clear. Both my daughters also use it to help keep their skin clear um, when they need it hormonally, they'll, they'll switch to that. Um, and that is a foaming pump. So just a few pumps, spread it over your face and rinse really well. Um, then it also has a very light moisturizer there on the left in the tall tube. And then the blend in the middle, which is a pure blend. Again, you could dilute it or just use it sparingly on, on problem blemishes. That is um, an alternative to the North Star blend that I suggested, one that's made by doTERRA, so you know it's all made perfectly. But you can dilute that if you want to go ahead and have something that's not quite so potent for your skin. And then the last line that doTERRA made is much more diverse. There's a lot of different products and choices here. So let's see, I'm going to start with the facial cleanser. Um, that is a peppermint. Um, it's more like kind of a paste that comes out of the tube um, when you squeeze it out and then rub it in your hands and spread it all over your face. It's not real soapy and foamy, but it does clean your skin beautifully. Um, and then follow that with the pore reducing toner. Um, if, if the toner from this line is the one that you like. It's great toner and I definitely don't want to put it down. My personal favorite is the pump from Barrage, but this is an excellent product I use for years as well. Um, and it does really reduce uh, large pores. So if that's a concern for you, keep that in mind. Uh, then after that, um, the anti-aging moisturizer smells amazing. It has all wonderful skin supporting oils in it and it has a real light almost like a jasmine kind of fragrance to it the fragrance is just so yummy um that's a nice light moisturizer uh i use that one as a day cream and then in the winter when i need a little more moisturizing or for my um chest or decolletage area 
um, the hydrating cream with that silver cap in the pot. That is amazing. It has the same essential oils in it. It's just a little bit heavier base. So if you need something a little heavier for more moisture or for an area, um, like for me, my chest, where I need a little bit more moisture, or if you're looking for a heavier night cream, um, the hydrating cream is a wonderful option. Again, they have the same ingredients, just the anti-aging moisturizer is a little bit lighter. Um, then we've got uh, some of the newer, well, let's see, let me go to the invigorating scrub on the far left. Hey, that, I, yeah. I just want to throw in that hydrating cream and that little tub. I have another gal in our organization that she calls that like skin crack, not like it cracks your skin, but like crack for your skin. Like you want to keep it on. <laughs> yeah, like you just can't get enough. Like, yeah, it's so good. And I also put it on the backs of my hands because I am kind of more along the mature skin line area and I have super fair skin. So it's been sensitive to sun over all the years, right? I love that hydrating cream. It's one of my favorite products in the whole line. And even though I kind of pick and choose from some of the different lines, which I'm sure you're going to talk about that later, I always have that hydrating cream as part of my routine. I just love it. It is wonderful. And the only thing I think is wrong with it, I wish, I wish it came in a larger jar. Right. <laughs> <laughs> because it is wonderful. And when you um, go ahead and put it on your face, you always have a little left on your hands. Just like you said, I put that on the backs of my hands. And then with a little bit of Immortel, I'll also massage my cuticles and nails because our na anything that's going to benefit our skin is also going to be really good for our nails because they're part of the same body system. And so I love to keep my cuticles moisturized. And I've noticed that my nails grow like never before. They just soak it up. They love the moisture and the essential oils in there are great support yeah. for nails too. And the backs of hands and evening out um, any discolorations. And so far so good. I don't have any of those spots. So doTERRA has been a real blessing that way. A um, couple more quick products I'll share. Let's see, we've got the invigorating scrub, um, probably about once a week or so, I'll, I'll go ahead and give them, and it's very, very gentle. It's not, when you think scrub, you might think rough. This is a really gentle scrub that just gently exfoliates. Um, they're, the beads that they use are not dangerous for our environment. They're no plastics. Uh, doTERRA uses bamboo silk beads, so they're natural from plant fibers, and they're not hazardous for um, fish or for um our environment. So that's really a nice thing. Um, the tightening serum laying down there in the picture does just that. It just kind of tightens, especially if you have mature skin. That's a really nice uh, addition to the skincare uh, regime that you can add on the top. And then finally, a wonderful um, new eye cream. And the eye cream has a wonderful applicator. You can see at the top of it, there's a stainless steel roller ball. And that roller ball is nice and cool. And so while it's gently applying a little bit of the eye cream underneath your eyes, it's also cooling. And so it really is wonderful for reducing puffiness um, and then also helping to nourish and support um, any little lines, wrinkles, or discolorations that tend to be in the delicate eye area. So that one is really wonderful. And then one last product, the brightening gel, which right now is sold out, but it should be back in stock soon. Let's hope so. That is really wonderful for lightening and brightening um, dark areas on the skin. And I do have several customers who rave about it for helping them with under eye darkness, which is a hereditary thing. Uh, usually it can be caused by other factors, but generally it's hereditary. So People again are told there's nothing you can do. And I just, I love it when people tell me I've been told there's nothing that can be done because that is a challenge that I generally overcome with one of our amazing products saying, well, try this and see what you think. So if you do have that issue, once it's back in stock, give the brightening gel a try. And I think you'll be amazed because it's really wonderful support that way. Hey, it's Rosie Gobert again. Thanks for watching the video. We're so happy to provide things here for you to learn all about using your doTERRA oils and your doTERRA products. Hit subscribe, like the video, and share this with somebody else you know that would love to learn too. See you next time.